Hi everybody, welcome back to Tip Tuesday. And this week we're gonna talk about when you have that little sore spot on your thumb, but you still need to bowl, how to protect it. Have you ever practiced so much preparing for a tournament and or league that you've worn a sore spot on your thumb? I've done it plenty of times. And there's ways that you can still protect it and still bowl effectively. The best way that I know how to do it is using new skin. I will first put a good layer of new skin directly on my skin, right where that sore spot is. And then I'll put the patch over the top of it. And then I will put a generous amount of new skin over the top of that patch to make sure that it's nice and secure onto my skin. I also make sure before I do anything else, make sure that that is really dry. You can hold it over the hand dryer, you can use a personal fan, or you can just blow on it. I'm somebody who uses the protective tape on the back of her thumb all of the time. So if I don't put that tape over the top of that new skin patch, it's gonna be very slippery in my bowling ball. So make sure that you may need to put that protective patch over the top of that new skin layer, or you actually may need to add tape into your ball once you put that new skin on your thumb. The first few shots may feel a little tender, but I promise your body will get used to it. One thing to really note at the end is don't just rip that off. You can rip skin off with it. I've done this in the middle of tournaments and then I've had to come back the next day and it's actually worse. So make sure you let that just wear off by itself or while you're washing your hands. I really hope this tip helps. Good luck out there and we'll see you next week. <laughs>